My YouTube account was completely hacked for 12 hours yesterday. No, this is not a lie. This is not clickbait. It's not anything. My actual YouTube account got hacked, and I'm here to tell you the whole story. If you guys were paying attention to my channel all the other day, you realized that I was posting these weird, like, crypto videos and, like, how to crack some random softwares. Obviously, that was not me. I'm going to tell you exactly what happened, how I lost all access to my YouTube channel for 12 hours, and Liddy had the worst day of my life. But if you guys are new here, make sure to like and subscribe. It would really help us out, especially after the awful day I had yesterday. But let's get into the story and how it all happened. But I am on my Minecraft server, the IP is Grouplings MC on uh, 1.19 Java edition. Everyone say what's up. I got a bunch of fans with me today. We were all just talking about what happened, and it was kind of crazy. But if you guys want to join, that is the IP. It's on 1.19 edition of Java and the Grouplings uh, MC is the IP, grouplingsmc.com. So this story begins yesterday at approximately 9 48 a.m. when my mother came into my room and she said, was saying that she got a bunch of emails from YouTube that all my passwords was changed, my telephone number, my two-factor authentication, everything was changed. I jumped out of bed quicker than you can even imagine. I, I, I was so scared. I was like, what, what, what is happening? What is happening? I tried to log into my YouTube account and I was completely signed out. So obviously the first thing I did was try to get back and I tried to put in my password and it said, your password was changed like two minutes ago or whatever and I, I i was so freaked out so at this point my dad comes in we're all trying to figure out what exactly is going on why can i get into my youtube account why can i not do anything and it got so bad to the point where i was physically shaking listen i don't get vulnerable on this channel and i've said this to these guys i really try to like keep my personal life out of the channel but i was actually like shaking and scared you guys don't realize like seven years of my life has been this YouTube channel. It's my baby. I love it. I love the community. I love the videos we make, everything like that. And it was suddenly gone. All of it was just gone. It wasn't in my control anymore. So I'm freaking out. I'm freaking out. My dad is trying to calm me down. He's like, listen, like try. Obviously he didn't call me that. I called him my real name. But he's like, listen, we, we can figure this out. Like there's got to be a way to get it back. And we were, uh, again, I was just freaking out. But we started to look for, for methods. So I'm frantically on my phone trying to find a YouTube support phone number or like a Google support number to try to get back my account. Of course, those things don't exist. The reason why is beyond me. I don't know why those things don't exist. So obviously my next course of action is to go on YouTube and see if this has happened to other creators. And I found out this actually happened to Linus Tech Tips, like a huge YouTuber with 15 million subscribers the other day. But I found this one YouTube video and it really helped me a lot. I want to give this guy a big shout out. His name is Joe Ritter and he basically the same exact thing happened to him and he really w helped walk me through the steps of what I should do. So basically the big way to contact YouTube is to uh, tweet them, which is like such a weird way to go, but you have to tweet at Team YouTube. So that's exactly what I did. I got a, a pretty quick response from Team YouTube telling me that they were going to DM me to help get my account back. So at this point, I'm still freaking out a little bit. I don't know if my account is going to get like get back. I, I don't know if this guy is going to like hack my videos and delete them all or like what he's going to do or if he's going to rebrand my channel. And that's when it happened. The first video got from the hacker, from the hijacker, got uploaded to my channel. And it, it was a crypto scam. It was a like really a crypto scam. So immediately I start freaking out even more. Like this guy is uploading videos on my channel. Like all my old videos are there. The whole branding is still there, but he's uploading videos. And I, I saw a lot of you guys in the comments being like, I, I think Try got hacked. I started to get a lot of messages on Discord. Like, I think Try is hacked. What is happening right now? And, and that's when it started to get really, really real for me. Like someone was on my account account that I spent seven years making posting random garbage. So during this whole freak out, I got a message back from team YouTube and they basically told me to fill out this like questionnaire to like prove the channel was mine. I answer a bunch of different questions about like my last uploads and different things like on the channel that like only the, uh, the owner of the channel would know, which, which, which is me by the way, not this crypto scammer guy. So I'm very careful. I go through this. I fill out the whole thing with all my details, like everything that I need to know, like that they, that they should know about exactly what happened and guys to be honest I didn't want to tell this part of the story but 
Yeah, I, I know exactly how I got hacked and, and who did it. So being a YouTuber, you have a people reach out to you all the time via email and Twitter talking about ad promotions and sponsorships. I don't think I like have ever done a sponsorship on the channel, but I got messaged by someone with a blue Twitter check mark who said they wanted to do it. So I, I was interested and I clicked, uh, you know, and started to talk to them in DMs. Basically, this person seemed 100% legit. They had a blue check mark. They had the company that they supposedly worked for inside their description. They had a lot of followers. So I figured, wow, th this is actually real. So through talking with this guy, he, he you know made me an offer and he said, well, listen, like I, I was really not sure it was for some app game. You know, I like app games. And I, I said, well, let me take a look at like the app game, send over the stuff. So he sends over the stuff and I'm taking a look at it and I start to realize that this is for like an NFT type play to earn game, which clearly is not something I would ever like support and want to do on my channel considering like I don't think my fans really like NFT guys guys do you like NFTs yeah yeah, yeah that, 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 that that's exactly that's exactly what I thought so I'm out on this like immediately like I'm like I, I clicked on it and I was like no 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 I basically like shut the whole thing down I said like I don't really think this is made for my type of audience like I'm not trying to sell out you know what I mean so yeah this random person on Twitter probably from you know some other country uh who's clearly a scammer and a hacker um that, that that's exactly how it happened as embarrassing as it is and then you know woke up the next morning and uh, my, my, my channel's gone yep we're back to the beginning of the story so I provided YouTube with all those like I knew exactly who it was I knew the account I knew everything and uh they basically got back to me and said yeah your channel is definitely hijacked it did not take long for them to realize that like um I'm a Minecraft YouTuber and I was not posting crypto scams and clearly I have been hacked so they said listen we're gonna get back to you we're gonna solve this you're gonna get your channel back and I, I thought wow th this is gonna be great I just don't know how long it's going to take so I'm waiting anxiously in bed feeling sick to my stomach as the chain I'm, I'm like literally refreshing my channel page and all of a sudden the two videos that they posted about the crypto scams are gone so this boy I'm like jumping for joy I'm like okay bet YouTube has gotten into my account they took the hacker off the account and like we're set they're gonna get my account back and then and then I realized um yeah, the hacker just started posting other videos about how to uh, crack like Sony Vegas and like other things, which by the way, were clearly all scams. So please tell me none of y'all click that link and big shout out to all the fans and the group link members in the comments. Cause I, again, I didn't have a YouTube account so I couldn't like comment on the video. So everyone's saying like, it's a scam. Don't click the links. Like big shout out to y'all. Y'all, y'all big brain, not like me. So at this point, I'm like, oh, oh, this is back. Oh, this is this is really, really not good. Like, I, I thought I was kind of in the clear. That sense of, like, dread in my stomach came back. But then I got another email from YouTube. YouTube basically said that, like, we know it's a lot going on because I was trying to get my channel back as quick as possible. But I know it's a really long process with a lot of different moving parts. Like, Google has all these subdivisions and they all got to get, like, checked out first. It, it's it's pretty crazy. So I got that email around 626 and I was actually out. I was driving in my car. I stopped to get gas. I stopped. I read that email and then I just sat in my car for five minutes and I really just let it sink all in. Like all my hard work, all the videos I loved were, were just suddenly gone. And it was at that part that I, I think more of like scared. I was just really like sad. I, I was broken inside. Like it's like this channel is like my child and you know, the community and, and everything to just have it be ripped away from you like that easily. It, it honestly like really shook me. But just when I thought, all hope was lost and I wasn't going to get my channel back today and I thought it might take a couple days because it was about to be the weekend like today is Saturday so I thought oh no they're not going to be in business. I got an email from Google saying that I could re-access my account and reset the password. So of course I opt in a call with my dad because I wanted to make sure it was legit and he said go for it and then we did it and then I changed all my passwords and the account Clearly, since I am not a hacker who's promoting crypto or trying to get you to download some link, was back! I immediately opted to a Discord call, which by the way, you can join my Discord link in the description or on the main channel page. You guys can find links to the Discord if you want to join it. Hopped in with all these boys right here, and I honestly just, I, I was really vulnerable. I, I started crying, started telling you how much uh, it meant to me. I was getting messages on Discord for fans throughout the day, telling me that they loved me, that they were gonna stick to with me no matter what. I really just got a sense that I really have an amazing community that backs me. And 
I, it was really like comforting all day when I was at my lowest of the low. Like this is probably like the worst thing that could have happened. Like that besides I don't know like death that was like really affected me and everyone was just sending me such nice words throughout the day and I started to get really emotional I started to cry in the discord call I know I know but like that's how much it meant to me but I got my account back I switched all the passwords I upped my security like when I say up my security like me and my dad were like boop, 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 boop. we got more security coming more things so if anyone's trying to hack me good luck buddy boy so the moral of this story is, as I'm now back on my account, you guys are seeing this video. Guys, don't, 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 don't like click random links. Like the internet is a scary place, okay? Like don't trust anything you read on the internet. Don't trust YouTube videos. Like if, if something looks sketchy, it probably is. And nothing in life is free. So if you want, you know, if it seems too good to be true, it, it probably is. And it could cost you, um, I don't know, I don't know, like your, your entire YouTube career if you're not careful. But we're back. I'm back with all the fans, and I'm honestly, today, just feeling great, grateful. Like, God is good, the channel is back, everything is amazing, but that's pretty much the story about how I got hacked for 12 hours yesterday, and I lost my YouTube channel, uh, or almost lost it for good. I want to give a really big shout out to Team YouTube, like, they were amazing through the whole process. I know everyone says that they have, like, slow times, but, like, think of how many creators they have to answer, and they really got my stuff done, like, really, really fast. So, Team YouTube, if you're watching this, which I doubt you are, like, really, thank you guys so much. So, yeah, my YouTube account was tagged for 12 hours, but now we have it back, and ain't nobody taking it. But guys, I hope you enjoyed this little bit of story time. I hope it provides some clarity if you're confused on what happened the other day. But uh, we're back. We're back, baby, with normal episodes and everything like that. So if you guys want to go get to the playlist, it'll be down here. If you guys want to go check out the best videos, it'll be up here. And if you guys make sure to subscribe, it'll be over here. Thank you so much, Pongro. We'll see you guys tomorrow back on my channel and my channel only. Peace out, guys. Bye. Everyone say bye. By the way, join the server if you want to. Come on.